How to do the alignment properly. In this video, we will show you how to align your CO2 laser machine quickly and accurately, and how to use it most efficiently with just proper setting, and to make high quality products without defects. This is Watson. Let us get started. Alignment is the process of adjusting the optical path and one of the most important adjustments of the machine. The optical path is formed as follows. A laser beam comes out of the laser tube, passes through three mirrors and enters the focusing lens and then onto the material. For maximum efficiency, the laser beam path must be set so that it hits the center of the third mirror while the cutting head, where the mirror is installed, is moving across the entire working area. If the beam hits the mirror at an angle, it results in defects. Poor cutting, reduced power output, split beam, thick or black cuts. You will need masking tape and a little time to carry out the alignment. On the panel, set the power to 20 to 25% and pulse short time radiation. Apply two to three layers of masking tape to the window in front of the first mirror. Be careful, if you stick one layer of masking tape, it may catch fire. Press Pulse. With short time emission, we can see the imprint of the laser beam on the tape. It is required to adjust the position of the mirror so that the whole imprint of the laser beam hits the window. Let us move on to setting up the second mirror. Apply masking tape and drive the laser head closer to the first mirror attached to the laser tube. Press Pulse. Mark the spot position. Drive the laser head to the opposite side. Press Pulse again. We can see that the first spot does not match with the second spot. Gently turn the screw, press Pulse, and mark the change. For this purpose, three adjustment screws are provided on the mount. Each of these screws deflects the mirror in its own plane. When we screw the top screw, the mirror deflects downwards, away from us. The lower left screw, the beam goes upwards to the right. Depending on how you want to correct the position of the laser beam, you need to turn the appropriate screw. The longer the Y-axis, the more the laser beam will be deflected. When the spots match with each other, move the laser head again and repeat the procedure once more. For the third mirror, the laser beam must hit strictly in the center of the window in front of the third mirror. Stick masking tape on. Press the pulse. Drive the laser head away to the opposite side. Do another pulse. The beam has gone up Accordingly, the mirror should be deflected downwards. Advice. The laser beam path can also be adjusted by moving the laser tube. As you move the laser tube to one side or the other, the laser beam will also shift. Let us test the results in practice. When you have adjusted everything so that the laser beam comes to the center of the third mirror, you can proceed to the final step, adjusting the position of the third mirror in relation to the focusing lens. For this, we will need adhesive tape. The principle is the same, but now the laser beam travels vertically. Stick adhesive tape to the nozzle so that there is the imprint on the tape. Press Pulse. Remove the tape and check. Our task is to make sure that the laser beam passes exactly through the center of this print. It should be a small round dot. It should not be oval or curved. The final test is to place a piece of plywood under the laser head and set the focal distance. Our task is to check once again that in any position of the laser head, there is a round little dot imprinted on the plywood. For a clearer print, you can increase the power to 60 to 70%. Well done. The adjustment has been successful. Secure all the screws. 
To do this, hold the screw with your fingers so that it does not shift and tighten the securing nuts with a spanner. However, do not over tighten the nuts as there is a great chance of damaging the screw. Let us check everything again. Once well aligned, a CO2 laser machine will provide equally high quality cutting on the entire working area. The alignment is over. You can get to work. Watson and Watson Technical, only relevant and useful information for owners and fans of CNC laser equipment. Subscribe and press like. See you in the next video.